Toe Hold Magic, shown in Nogi. So let's go ahead and break it down. In catch wrestling, we call this like a step over toe hold position. So step over toe hold position. Some uh, people who do nogi will probably call it double outside ashi position, or sometimes a, I know a lot of people call it DOA or double outside. Okay, so the, what what's going on here is this foot. Okay, instead of the knee being in between my legs, it's going to come out here. Okay, so and then because a lot of people think this is safe. Right, they're going to put the outside foot over. So the outside leg over this leg, so I can't just uh, push this down or I can't easily peel this off. But what was really cool in that match is that regardless of uh, this, what's happening down here, right, the person was able to then keep this down, push this, start, start to push this down, and they started using some toe hold magic here. So it's like the push pull action, right? And then let's see how, how my partner can do it. So a lot of times, I mean, you can even start working this, right? Like this here, right? And this is the toe hold here, okay? If, if the foot comes out of here, you can start staying over it like this, like that, okay? So the main thing you wanna do and why it was so cool that it happened in the match was that you want to be going like grabbing the, the toes here, come around the back, right? Get that figure four, right? And then really you want to start hugging it to your chest and then you can even use your body, right? To start going for it, right? So instead of keeping it away from your body, you can hug it and then start going for it, okay? So hopefully that can help you uh, understand how this worked and you can apply it so that you can like stay threatening to everyone right no matter what position they think they have right no matter how safe they think they are okay so subscribe here check out some more videos over there see you in the next video